folks, welcome back to Forever Skies. Yeah, haven't played this for a while. Just had a new update, and we're apparently in a lightning storm. Where are we, by the way? We're up in the air, too. Hmm. Um, I have no idea where we are. I just turned the game on. We seem to be out in the middle of nowhere. Oh, we're at something over here. That's where we are. Okay, so let's jump into this and drop. How do I do that? Control, that's right. Been a while. So, big update. Viral evolution update, I think is what they're calling it. Get down into the 220s. Now the storm is over. Boom. Felt like we just hit something. What's going on out here? Something underneath us? No. No. Where are we here? I'm not sure, but my volume is so low I can't hear it. So... You will notice there's a bunch of yellow on the bar there. And my understanding, they have redone the health and, and uh, your immune system. The, the yellow circle there on the left. Let's see if I can if I tab. There we go. So this guy right here doesn't just go down every time your stats are low now. Now, if you keep your stats up, it will max you out and keep you there until you stress yourself and then your immunity will drop a little more natural. So let's go fill things up as far as foods and waters. Um, nothing in there. Nothing in there. We had no food saved up. We had no food saved up. Okay. So get you going. Let's see. That is hold the E. I got to get used to these controls again. Oh, man. Playing Sunken Land, you use the F to get to activate things. So now you see the arrow indicating we're in an upward climb right here. When I get some food in me, let's see, grab that one. So, oh, nope, I'm hitting the F in the last game. Yeah, I think I'm maybe getting too old to be going from game to game when the controls don't match. <laughs> Trying to remember. Yeah. When I first started playing Sunken Land, I was so used to using the E. This game uses E on everything. So you either are touch the E or hold the E. So you go into Sunken Land, open up a chest with F. You revert back to autopilot and hit the E to close the, the lid. And everything inside the chest slams into your inventory, your, your backpack because E is take all. <laughs> now this turned out to be just a decoration, but I'm still leaving it there just for a statement. <laughs> We're gonna turn this into our, our onboard greenhouse if it ever becomes a thing. Anyway, so since we ran this game last, we... Something's decreasing. Calorie levels, there it is. We, um... There's a tool available for the repairs. You can still use this. Let's see if we have anything to repair out here. Um, are we banging into anything lately? Immunities decrease in diseases might become more severe. Okay. Looking for anything to repair. This should still work like normal. It did when I was goofing around on another save last night. Just to remind myself how to play the game. <laughs> anyway, I got my ship's in perfect shape. I got nothing to fix. Uh, let's grab some food. Nope, not C. Hold the E. Yeah, okay, that maxed that out. And let's grab some rest. Bedroom. Cool. I gotta relearn my own, my own ship. This is what I wish was in Sunken Land so badly. To wake up whenever you want to. Sleep as long as you want to. Have some control. Maybe I just want a quick nap. But now there is incentive to keeping your your stats up. Now you can see this guy is just vibrating like crazy saying, we're climbing, we're climbing, we're climbing. Pretty soon your immunity is going to be fine again. And it doesn't drop just as soon as you start to lose these bars. They can go down quite a ways and you still hold full immunity. At least that's what it did for me last night. So anyway, um, the repair tool is somewhere under the dust so we need to go visit that somebody just hit us and we've got 
new enemies in the game. We've got some of these towers that are infected with a colony of oh, biologicals, we'll call them. Some kind of flora that that is like a fungus. And I think there is a new critter that comes out of them or has something to do with them that will bite you and infect you with something. So we'd have more than just the cricket now. And so we've got our, our lab set up. I'm trying to remind myself how this all works. Here's the lab over here. These, let's see, does it pop up a name? E, virus sample. No, it doesn't give you a quick name for what this device is called. Interesting. Let's pop over here. Use printer. Where is that? That's upgrades only. U, tools. Ship workstation, upgrade station. You're not listed here. Where is that guy? That in here? No, nope, that's that's the F. You're going to see my flashlight a lot. Because, uh, no, lighting and furniture and paint tools. So, I don't remember. Where do you build this guy? Has to be in here. Upgrade. Workstation, Recycler, Fabricator. Okay. It would be back over with these guys. There you are. Virus Sample Analyzer. That's what it's called. That's what we'll call our lab. Anyway, we've got to get into these guys. There's more of them now. They have to do with your immunity and for, uh, you know, like a an anti virus sort of a thing so with all of that just to kind of get me going again my immunity's back up and running so we're good there uh, inventory's looking pretty good let's open everything up yeah I've been hitting F for the last month running uh, running sunken land so there we go five there so this guy still works but when we find the the other one, the new one, it will plaster a, a a device with a bunch of goo that comes out of these little packets that are in our our five bar there, our five space, and apply it better. Hello, Poncho. Forgot about you and our creepy little gnome. Okay, so where are we going and why? What is this place that we're at? Hmm. I see a triangle there. Oh, so it's this guy here? Let's hop up there and find out. So jump into this and rise up. I don't know if the ship's got fuel. Well, we've got three quarters of a tank. Um, was this the really tall tower? Let's back up a little bit. I don't know what I'm coming in under. Okay, that was the really tall tower. We did that one. Um, does it say if we get closer what it's called? High point. That's what you're called. Okay. So that's high point, and we got the the uh, gangplank right there in front of us from there. And we got the recycler from there, didn't we? How do I get out of this? There we go. We got this guy from there. Yeah, so that was where we ended last time. Okay. So... Where am I? Almost 10 minutes into my introduction. Where should we go from here? <laughs> we need to get to an underdust. There is that. Um, underdust. Can I point? I can. So that guy right there is an underdust. Whereas these are greenhouses, if I remember right. Alright. I think so. Let's head that direction and find out. Nope, that's the wrong one. Yeah, going from one game to another breaks my brain. We're going that way, around. Yeah, there's the the curly, gnarly branch landscaping around where the underdust is. And we've probably been to that underdust. Is there another option anywhere? There is one way down there at the bottom. Uh, I can't tell how far away that is. We have to travel for a while, but... Yeah, let's do that. What just beeped? You turbine damage max altitude is lowered. Okay. Um, I'm spinning around further. Am I trying to lift? Oh, I'm holding my shift button down. 
go forward. Oh, because in Sunken Land, the shift button is faster. So you hold the W to go forward, you hit the shift, and, and it uh, takes you forward even quicker. Um, like a, a turbo or a boost. So yeah, I'll be doing that a lot for a while too, until I get used to these controls again. Okay, so let's lock you in. I've never actually done that. Where is that? You're down here somewhere. Um, lock speed R. Okay, E. I've always driven, not autopiloted. But I want to check the engines. Boy, where are the engines on the ship now? You're up here? Health. We do need to fix you too. Let's drop down and five. Okay. Why is that not working? There you are. Top you off. How you doing? You're fine. Not falling down onto the ground. Oh, that was pretty well damaged. And yep, you're damaged too. Now these engines. Am I gonna crash in anything? Looks okay. <laughs> Living dangerously here. Uh, e, what are we looking at here? Oh, we've got quite a bit of fuel in these guys. Okay. Oh, there's damage down there. Okay, drop. And I have no more repairs on me. Okay. So let's run back over here, see where we're going. Poncho's driving. Uh, let's R out of that into this guy. We're going to park where? Around the backside. And for all I know, I've been to this one too. I don't know. There have been, there are several of these on the map. But, don't know how much distance we've actually traveled. Alright, so how to till our altitude? Looks like we're a bit high. Right about in there. What is that? 300, 299? That sounds about right. Seems like it was around the mid-290s. Does that seem right? Hydration. Alright, let's drop in like that. Drop in. So there's mid 80s? Mid 80s. Descent to the under dust reach. Whoa, that was quick. Okay. Drop in there. Pull out of you. And what did it want? It wanted a drink and something to eat. Let's grab that. Um, hold the E. That's right. So maxed you out. And drink couple of those. Sleep will be fine for now, though that also has to do with stamina. They reworked stamina a little bit. I'm not sure how that was, but let's just grab a couple of hours. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. Again, Sunken Land, please do that to your game. Oh, that's nice. Um, what do we need to bring? Under dust. That means batteries. Boy, I don't remember where things are in here. Okay, out over here. No. Batteries, batteries, batteries. By the battery charger. Does that sound right? That sounds logical. Down here? No. <laughs> How about here? No, that's all foods. I gotta relearn my ship. So you are metals and synthetics. You are all of the earlier parts that we found and all of the no I take it back you are materials and you are components that's how I divided those up I need to get labels on these and down here you are other materials apparently and liquids so what do I do with batteries what are you okay you are laboratory like things fuels here we go crystals and crystal batteries perfect we'll drop you on there i don't see needing another one of you um, we do need the, the potential of defending ourselves i saw that that was down that was here yeah so you are my number four the knife is my number three and a stack of bolts okay so i don't know that we really need any more what happened there five um liquids 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 here no no there no <laughs> liquids there eh? gotcha do we need any more plant resin Is 
is there another big bottle in here? There are little bottles. What's it take to make a big bottle? Uh, right there, big bottle is 5 polymer and 15 synthetics. Polymer was down here. We have 6. And synthetics are here. I'm learning. Yep, it's all coming back to me. Okay, let's make a bottle real quick. So we've got... Let's pop some more of these in here. Um, okay, that leaves one. Yeah, so we have a definite designated dirty water bottle. And we have a definite clean water bottle. Printing completed. So that leaves us with a resin bottle. Okay, so now what are we doing? I think I've got all that we would need down under. Got our bigger oxygen tank. We've got defense. We've got batteries. Um, don't need the polymer. So there's one space, although we're going to find a bunch more down there. But you can go in here, and I think we're ready. So let's go see what uh, what trouble we can get ourselves into. All right, so there's the stamina. It's still going down really fast. And going up quicker? I think that was it. It was supposed to be going up quicker. You are hmm for sale not getting any sense of being able to interact with anything sometimes there are artifacts here that you can't find anywhere else but I don't see anything there that I can use okay so we'll skip that we grab this battery and pop up here that's something to get used to also in sucking land you don't need to push a button to interact with the ladder you just walk up to it and immediately that's not where I'm going and immediately start going up whereas this one you have to push a button you have to tell it that you want to climb so yeah games do the same things in very different ways don't need that elevators here let's go down uh, there and let's see if the transition is any better. The optimization used to lag really hard right in here. Uh, a little bit of lag in there. Yeah, we're bouncing. Yeah, we're loading in the new map. New resources. I've got her voice turned down too low. But there's new objects down here needing scanning. That would be the repair tool. Yep, really, really laggy. Okay. Let's let the lag kind of get figured out here. Back and forth. Alright. Grab these guys. And three. Bang him. So this is a different layout than... Well, maybe not. When we first came out of the other one, that guy was right there. Some of these... Um, of these underdress dusts, they will rotate this and put the door out on the other side. Or, so that when you look out you're actually opening up maybe over there or over there so it looks very different even though it's the same everything else is the same okay so let's dive in here and let's see I don't need any bolts let's go ahead and do the the things the under dust things take advantage of the supplies that are here can always use another transformer though I don't need any more first aid kits that's for sure don't need don't need these guys right now I don't know how much more I need to do as far as um, learning new plants and viruses and diseases and that kind of thing um, can I get you from here no so I'm trying to remember I think it's down the tunnel oh the tunnel okay back to the elevator which is where? Right over here. Put you away. Elevator. We forgot the uh, uh, the stimulant that allows us, that drops our body temperature down to go into the tunnel. I think that's where the repair tool is. So let's run back to the ship and grab that. Little by little, this game will be coming back to me. I've been I've been on a deserted island for the last uh, month or so. So. Kind of forgot about what it what it's like to fly a an airship. 
All right, so even though our bars are dropping somewhat, our immunity is still fully maxed out. So you can get a sense of how the immunity works now. Okay, so I need... Let's walk back over here and see if we already have these built. If not, I need to remind myself how to make them. So we're talking about improves breathing. Okay, so to make the other ones, endurance, temporarily increases stamina, and hypothermia, uh, needs photophobia, okay, and a medical reagent. The heck's a medical reagent? Okay, I'm not sure what that is. Um... Um, medical reagent. Okay. Yeah. You do what for me? We just drop something in there. Okay. Medical reagent. You are only paints. Okay, you're not it. Upgrade over here. There's nothing that I haven't seen. Nope, nothing there. So... Is there anything new to research that has been given to us because of the update? No. Okay. Well, I don't know what a medical reagent is. And it used to be the energy crystal. Yeah. Let's just grab an energy crystal just to have it in our inventory and try this again. But And let's see, it was also a what? Uh, photophobia. Let's grab a photophobia and see if it gives us any hints. Uh, vertigo and pyrexia. Uh, yeah, none of these are going to help. So photophobia are sun melons and crickets. I don't know that I can do anything with that here. There are no sun melons in this place. And there are no crickets in this place. So best I can tell, we need to go find ourselves a greenhouse. Yeah. Or a... The small town also had melons. And some of the smaller uh, platforms. So I guess we're kind of done here until I can get some photophobia and figure out what the heck a... What would we call that thing again? A... Let's see, that's here. A medical reagent. So if I click on you, anything, that's the booster. Okay. Um, any sense of a database? Um, blueprints, studies, what studies? Viral analysis. So we need to find this one and this one. These are newer. Okay, so to get to photophobia. Well, we can't see it there, but... Oh, so it's a daisy or a melon. Dust daisy, that's here. Okay. But still, I don't know what the other one is. Let's go grab a dust daisy. So, yeah, this episode is going to be just, be me just kind of figuring out this all works <laughs> I'm just glancing up there at the list of to do's find research reports in the laboratory research reports in the laboratory is there a chance that there's something new in the laboratory up here is that what this means maybe they've added something the assumption that if you're playing the game new or from scratch, then you will have found that naturally. But we didn't. Now I need the tool to get into here, right? No, that wasn't the door. Um, there. And we need to get a 
Dust Daisy. That's you? That's you. But let's go here first. Battery, thank you. Let's see if we can get here before the oxygen runs out. There's my halfway gasp. 50% <laughs> gasp. Okay. Alright, so we'll pop you into here. And refill. Okay. So is there anything new up in here? Let's grab the scanner. We already know this guy. We already know this guy. We'll take that. And those. And a drink. But if it means this laboratory, I'm not seeing anything new. So if I pass over that, extracts viruses, allows further study. Pass over this. Dust has changed the world. Uh, also, we need a virus sample to craft a booster, but it would also be helpful uh, to look for something for those heat-sensitive weeds. That's all the same thing as last time. So, what am I missing here? Anything up here? No, just lots of cans of water. Nothing behind. Some old food. Okay, so this didn't help. Well, let's grab a drink of water, keep our immune system in good shape. I'm not getting the sense I'm missing something here. Nothing in there, nothing underneath. You're nothing. So going to the laboratory didn't help. Nothing back in there. Okay, well, drop out of you, go around. Don't know why I'm out here. Feels like I'm about to fall. How do you get down from here? There was a ladder, right? Ah, it was you. Yeah, let me go. And there goes my oxygen. Okay, so, no, I'm still on the ladder. Come on, jump. There we go. Drop. Okay. So let's go fire off an oxygen booster in here. That one was. Yep, it is. I think it was right over here. That's why you bring the extra batteries. All right, so that didn't help. So it said research and immunity booster. Hmm. Okay, so let's grab this guy and maybe several of them. Okay, let me in there. Okay, we'll go to another one. Fine. Uh, Dust Daisy, you guys over here. And grab you just for fun. Inventory full. Okay. Eat. Drink. And I noticed the uh, the, the Coca-Cola of this game doesn't give you a lot of extra energy anymore. Used to. Drink you up. And call that good. Grab you. Anything over here that was important. Too bad there's no way to... Get to, oh, that's right. You're right there. You can't be done that way. All right, fine. Shoot you and grab those extras and use you. Okay, half oxygen left. Put you away. And there's a critter over there to go and grab some more samples. Did that say full again? It did. Okay, never mind. Let's just go back. So I can fit you, right? Yeah. Oxygen. Oxygen level, isn't it? Yep, it is. We'll be fine for a little bit longer. So I can't fit another one of you. So it's one per slot. That's a bummer. All right, so let me think a moment here. I don't need you. So let's drop you into here. 
And weren't there two foods? No, I guess it was two drinks. That's what it was. Um, don't really need you. So with that, let's grab a couple more dust daisies. There we go. So let's go experiment with these guys and see see what's up. That didn't do me any good. Let's hit that button. Let's hit all the buttons. <laughs> so I believe I can make that directly, but is there anything else to do with this guy? So we already know the answer to this one. This didn't do any good. It's red. This one, we already know how to do it. We don't need to do that again. Now we just use it to make it. So that's just over here. and But we still have to have a medical reagent. Hmm. Well, I just went online and looked up medical reagent. And apparently it is here in the underdust. So... Not a lot of information out there. I don't even know what I'm looking for. So let's wander around, I guess everywhere except for the tunnels and see what can be found Just kind of exploring the game all over again they changed the rules on me <laughs> yeah it's hard to go back to a, a game that you've you've hibernated or you know, a series you put on hold enough things change and you're, you're kind of lost for a while all right well, let's see what we've got Alright, so they claimed it was... I'm still full. Okay, so I just dumped everything off in the, the bins there. Anyway, it said that the medical reagents are at the laboratory. Did you say anything new? Under dust, uh, we assemble, team, recover. Yep, same message from before. Nothing out around here. Bunch of supplies good supplies right over there. I need to come back for that. Alright, let's go back up there again. Uh, back up there means over here. And this time I'm just gonna stop that from laughing at me. Okay. Oh, we have a difficult time jumping. Yeah, he's, he's not very uh, talented here. Let's see, doing that. Alright, so what did we miss? I just saw a piece of plastic. Oh well, don't get distracted. Alright, we just hit our 50% gasp there. There we go. So, there is something here, they said there's two of them, called a medical reagent. I don't know what that means. I hate it when things are not intuitive, not obvious. There is nothing flagging me. Nothing says, hey, I'm new. How did I not see that battery? Okay. <laughs> First aid kit. You want to be something, but you're not. No. Okay, let's try here again. Huh. I don't have an answer. Come on, just go down. Okay. <laughs> well, scan. Nothing pops up, except that guy, that guy, and that guy. Nothing new. Nope. Okay. Well, let's go exploring. Got some air. I wish I could just... Let's just drop. Yep. Yeah. Always get hung up in there trying to get down that ladder. It just doesn't work that well. So, looking around for anything else that's flagging my attention. We've been there. Right there. No, can't reach it. Okay. 
Don't need any more of those guys. The other ones might spoil before we get back. I don't know what the timer is like on those now. Um, in here, let's clean out any goodies. Don't need that one. We've got a pathway up here. Oh, he has such a hard time jumping. Yeah, jumping in other games is much easier, much smoother than this one. I've always noticed that, that the jump reflex seems quite delayed. So it's not like Minecraft or even even Sunken Land I've been playing is much more responsive than this one. So I've got to anticipate it and jump way ahead of time is what it feels like. Okay, let's top you off. There we go. And any other goodies around here? That's right, we have a, a destination over here. Yeah. Wow. There we go. There. There. Oh, yeah. That's one more try. There. Okay. Okay, I'm giving up on that one. Not that important. Okay, grab that oxygen again and move on to what? Where am I? There you are. You can turn around here real easy. So we have this out. Nothing in there. Anything new? Any new plants? You, we've seen before. Um, let's see, knife. I'm pretty sure we tried to analyze that once. Uh, you, we can never do anything with. And we can't scan you. Now, you've been scanned. So, got some plastic right over there. Not going to let me. Okay, pop down this. Hello. What else is in here? We did see this. No, it wasn't. I thought that was one of those creatures that have the uh, the sores on them that you can make virus boosters out of. Don't remember what those critters are called. Well, that was bigger. That's more than a critter. Critters are little things. This guy is a beast. All right, let's grab some air. Which is here, yeah. Okay, so... Let's go collect these. We know we have some goodies over here. Now, how do you get to that one? You jump across all those places, okay. But over here, good transformer, some more polymer. Food and water. Okay. Right there. We'll grab those. Across here. Nothing. Nothing in the... Nope. Okay. Grab all of these. What you got there? That didn't need that. Let's just... Now, can I do that? I can't. Drop you right there. All right, so from here, nothing. So drop into there. Grab all the plastics, which I don't really need, but it's, it's still fun to get them. <laughs> all right, so this room. What have I got? Half oxygen? Yep. This one, which gets us to here and over here, and an empty bottle we don't need, but we'll grab that, and that's it. Oh, I can grab that on the way down. Okay, oxygen. I'm going to drop off, then we'll go hit another area. So... That stacks. 
those stack. No, nope, we're, we're done there. And those stack. Okay, there. Looks like you and you. And eat, eat, drink, drink. It won't let me. Oh, interesting. Yeah, it's got to be in your own inventory to use it. Okay. So, do that. Any of the old sodas? Nope. Okay. Hello. Let's this time go through here. And we haven't been up here this, this trip. So there, there, drop down into here. Let's see, grab these on the drop. Any others that are up high? Maybe you. Okay. And that one. Used to be two. Yeah. Used to be two plastics here. They always taunted you if you missed them. Nope, don't see them this time. Okay. Over here. This looks like another place to jump up and fail miserably. There we go. Grab you. There. That one. Alright, where does this go? Over here. Top of this. Another crystal. Across this way. Whoa. And... That gets us to over there. Okay. And looking in a window. Interesting. This used to be the outside of a of a building or the inside of a building. And drop down. I saw something. I think it was a polymer I missed. Hmm. Um polymers, grab all you guys. Okay. So we'll call that done for getting random supplies. Though, could grab these while I'm here. Let's now head to the areas that we can't get to and see if anything's changed over there. So drop off you, you, and plastics. Okay. So those areas were where? Through this and through that door. Yeah. So in here, we... No, not this one. Now, just trying to reorient myself here. That's where we eventually end up. So there's another exit further around ah this one around this corner again still looking for new plants new anything that I don't recognize grab you um that's the other side can't get past him though we could now that we've got the uh, we can, no we can't that's right we don't have this medical reagent so that must be found somewhere else now. Over there. You, you. So medical reagent. Maybe, I know that there are now bees in the game that we find at various greenhouse-like places. Um, how do we get to the other one? The other one was blocked. We have to knock down a barrier that opens up something, like in here. Yeah. So it's not this one, it's it's around the corner here. From here? Yeah. So this bar right here we have to get from the other side. And you have to go through the tunnels to get there, I believe. I don't think there's a way to sneak a peek at it from here. No. Okay. All right, so I think we've kind of done all that we're going to do here then. Until we figure out what this medical reagent is. So let's head up. Uh, what can I, what do I bring with me? 
What is most important? We'll leave that behind. We can get this anywhere, though that's an awful lot of it. I must have brought that with me accidentally. Hello, game. Stop lagging. Don't you crash on me. Um, we'll grab you. We'll grab those. We'll just eat that to make space. Don't really even need the drinks. I do want these, though. Um, only 15 metal. We'll wait on that. You, what's most important here? Okay, will you guys go together? You will. So I want three of you. I'll go make the oxygen boosters. Grab all those. Polymers are important. Meteor bean. Plastics. We have way more first aid than we need. So let's grab the ten of those. Um, I'll run back and grab these. Rather than being satisfied with only part of our loot. We aren't that far away. Though, with energy level right there, I may as well be ten miles away. Okay, let's run for another three seconds. Oh, exhausted again. <laughs> yeah, I think that's a little bit too much. Just, unless it is based upon how much you're carrying. Otherwise, it doesn't make sense to, to run, you know, 30 feet and be exhausted. Um, what am I doing? Let me unload all this and grab those and I'll get right back. Okay, so everything's unloaded. I need to grab some sleep, but research and immunity booster. They're talking about this guy. So in order to do that, I need a fungal meningitis. And that doesn't do any good to click on it. <laughs> okay, so fungal meningitis pyrexia gastroenteritis. Oh, those sound nasty. So we've got pyrexia. That's one of them. Fungal meningitis. We've got one. There's the mantis glands that I didn't see a mantis down there. But not much I can do with that. I just want to make sure that I'm not just missing something obvious here. So none of these are made with the mantis glands. Not a thing. A medical reagent. Boy, I wish there was a pop-up explaining what that meant. Yeah. So, now how did we... Let's just jump into here and do one of these again. I kind of want to refresh my memory. I thought I grabbed it. I didn't. I didn't. Grab you. So those are oxygen boosters. Let's put you in here. I only need one. Analyze. Okay. So, reminding me how to do that. This is our goal right here. We're getting rid of everything else. So, oh, so virus sample is known. Continue. Ah. So we don't have to go through the whole process again. It will just give it to us. Okay. So over here, you are pyrexia. Okay. Pop a new battery in there. So we have plenty of pyrexia. We have more than enough of fungal meningitis. 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 That sounds a little better. And and it's it's raining inside. <laughs> okay, let's go find a greenhouse. Preferably one that isn't already infected and is gonna kill us before we figure out how to not be infected. Alright. Um, lift off. There we go. So, a greenhouse around here looks like what? Um, I think all of these around the perimeter are greenhouses. So, the only one point, unless, let's spin around a little bit here, 1.3 is out that way. Let's go that way. Um, I see them. There's one right there and one right there. Okay. I uh, don't see any lights. That means we've been to these, haven't we? What was the flash? I saw a quick flash out here somewhere. Okay, there's a light starting to form there. But these guys right here... 
Am I wrong? No, I'm wrong. Those are skyscrapers. Really tall skyscrapers. Aha. We're at 293. So, food and water and sleep. I need to sleep. So I'll do that before we take off. Yep, that's the uh, the Empire State Building right there. Aha. Uh -huh. Head over here. Which one of these landings looks like they're the easiest route back up? Um, let's go around the back side and see if there's a third landing spot there. Both of those look awfully far down below the uh, the top the the floor you can actually walk on. If I can keep from climbing a ladder, that'd be great. But is there anything around it? Boy, it's hard to see through those railings. Let's drop down. Ah, uh, wrong button. And there's our our sentry bots. Um, let's go further down. I can see what I'm doing. Yeah, there's a ramp, but I don't think it goes up to a ladder. I would think it goes up to a ladder, not right up to the deck. But we'll call that good enough. You settle down right in there. Yeah. I like having a ship that's not so big that you can't just land it. Yeah, the gangplank, it's, you know, it's doable. Yeah, you send it on, let's see, extend is W, and then aim it wherever you want. It's doable, ugh, but it's a skinny little thing to walk out on, I gotta say. I'm, yeah, I, I'd rather just step right off a deck onto a big old landing. I just feel so much better. But yeah, there's a ladder at the top there. Um, inventory is fine. I didn't sleep. Let's go do that real quick. Or running is going to be exhausting the whole time. All right. Quick nap. Well, maybe not so quick of a nap, but either way. Drink, drink. And something to eat, which we, I've just discovered, have a lot of. Let's just go through these guys. That's food. I um, have to do that and then do that. Okay. Um, food. Six down there. Food. Four over there. Yep. Shelves are getting full. So let's start taking advantage of that. Old tuna fish. Actually, those are more like what? Sardines? Yeah. Cans of sardines. All right. Up this guy. And let's see what is over here. I don't see, in fact, I haven't really, whoa, stopped to look out in the distance. Those new fungal enemies, floating colonies of fungus that can attack your ship. They're out there somewhere, but I'm not seeing anything on the horizon around us that's similar to that. Here's our ship. That's a nice looking ship. I like that. That's a good good shape. Whoa, that I've never seen before. That's new. Look at the the atmosphere down the the dust layer just creeping and oozing. They've done a good job with that. That's that looks ominous. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Okay. So, I don't know what we're heading to. We're heading toward Oh, this does look a little different. At least the colors are more vibrant. Are there different flowers? A storm is coming. A storm is coming. I'm going to just write this one out. There's something chittering and chirping in here. Where are you? There you are. Yeah, you're you're down. I'll, I'll eat you. Oh, another one. Okay, I'll eat you too. Any more? Another creepy gnome. Okay, plants, patats, and petites, patats and petites, and bruise flower, and there's an ink bulb in here somewhere. I don't know that I need any of those. We've already done all of the research on these. So, medical reagent, I don't know what that means. Those words are not coming up in the descriptions at all. So I don't think it's something we already know. Must be something new to discover. There's an ink bulb. Nothing there either. Okay. Let's 
try not to get hit by lightning. Gotta go up into here. Let's see if I can get up there and into... Nothing's going to slice me open here. Any more critters? No. Any new bulbs? Any new flowers? Bruise, patat, canola. Nothing new here. Okay. Um, let's run across here. Those lightning strikes come in sets of four. Great. And the four is starting again. Get me in here. Okay. Any more critters in here? Any new plants in here? Nothing. Okay. Ooh, but we will definitely take all the coffee we can find. Let's see, there's a big old hole, right? Whoa, that hit nearby. Nope. I need to get up on the roof to get more coffee beans. I'm not doing it right now. <laughs> Okay, so we have not been in there. So I don't see anything. Yeah, the storms I've noticed when I go to edit the videos always come in four strikes of four. There's possibly more coffee right there, too. So I'm going to wait this storm out. I think we're on two sets of four so far, rather than get hit by lightning. Well, I've been standing here for a while, and... It's still raining, but there's been no more lightning strikes, so I'm guessing that is done. Alright, let's pop into here. Okay. Any new flowers in here? Nothing. Virus infection detected. Virus infection detected? What? How did I just get a virus? Okay, but is it just because I'm in the proximity of where this virus lives? Even though my immune system was maxed out? I don't know what to make of that. So this game seems to be really refocusing itself based upon viruses. More so than airships. That seems to be a major, major focus. Uh, more coffee. I'm just on a permanent, eternal search for coffee. Um, up in there, there's more. How does one get up in there? Ah, well, how about up the ladder? Okay. Up here. Hopefully, hopefully as I am doing these, this searching, I will f discover something that is new or different. Now, I saw a coffee bean from down there. How come I don't see it now? Ah, uh, there? Okay, I think I got it. Alright, drop into here. Uh, let's grab a battery while we're here. So, feel free in the comments to fill me in on anything that I don't know. I don't need to discover it all on my own. Instead, I'd rather just enjoy the game and not knowing where to even find a medical reagent or even what it is it takes away some of the fun of the game because I don't even know what I'm looking for. It's like they changed the rules on me and didn't leave any hint as to the instructions. So, we're good there. Oh, one more at that point. Okay. I, oh, I've got the vertigo going on. Whoa. Okay, so a patat solved that. I can just do that and be done. So, give me a patat. You are a patat. So, consume E. The immune system has dealt with a viral infection. Has dealt with a viral infection. And yet, I still see this bar right here. I'm trying to figure out what that means. Am I heading up or am I heading down? Hmm, I don't know. But I wonder if it's because I'm holding on to these critters. They're in my inventory. 
that I've caught the disease rather than consuming it. Which seems a little bit... Uh, oh, yeah. I'm not liking jumping in this game. Let's go back up. Alright, so any surprises in here? I saw a preview, I don't know if it's in the the trailer for this update or what, of a critter, not worm-like, well, bug-like of some kind. Plant oils, I don't think I need any of those that just reached out and bit the arm right there and suddenly you're contaminated. So there is still another critter somewhere that isn't a cricket that has the potential to do some damage. I want to get down there. So I'm keeping my knife out just in case. A little easier to see around it than the uh, than the crossbow. I will definitely take all the polymer I can find. Okay, we're done here. Seem to be. And this guy, two of them. Ew. How does one get into there? I'm hoping to find another data pad. That might hold a clue as to what's going on. What I'm missing. No data pad here. Maybe I need to go find some some uh, low-level platforms where I can find something like a data pad. All right, getting into here, too. Does that let me in? That lets me in. All right, put you away. Nope. There's my data pad. All right, moss wall shelf. No, that's pretty much where we left off. So nothing new there. Don't need the oils. Don't really need the epoxies either, but yeah, we're here. Oh, branch is coming through there. So how do I get through this? Just kind of force my way over. Ah, yep, force your way over. Not very graceful. <laughs> Just do it. <laughs> okay, so nothing inside there. Nothing inside these. Ah, you and you, take both of you, both of, I'm full, okay. All right, so what is that? Canned water. Um, I'll consume it. Thank you. Now, can I get over? Can I get under? Nope, I'm stuck now. Nope, does not like that, so try and go over. Okay, try this again. From here, run, jump, crouch, in. Okay, so we are done here. Don't see anything new. Use this guy to get down. And virus pyrexia is decreasing over there, that yellow bar. I don't have the effects anymore. I have... I ate the patat and got the immunity from... The, whoa, I just got a little fuzzy there. Oh, I am still coming down with this. So, I keep running. It's like I'm stuck on running. There we go. Um, so, that immunity... Purified virus. So, was there something to take that cures you of it? So, pyrexia is it, right? See, I can't pass over that with my mouse and read anything. So let's do it from here. Pyrexia, uh, cold with a viral origin. Okay. There's vertigo. So this is the purified virus, so we don't want to take that. So fungal then gives you... Fungal gives you the oxygen booster. Okay, but it doesn't necessarily cure the disease. Hmm. Now, my immune system was maxed out. So I would think I would be immune to catching things unless it was directly put into me, like if I got bit by the cricket. 
So that was kind of a surprise. Let's... Can I do anything with the cricket? I guess I can just make another one of those. I'll take you... Swap you with a cricket. There we go. Analyze the virus. We've already done this, but now it's going to make you do it again. All right, well, we'll do it again. So, we are... It's this guy right here. He's a small virus. He's... Oh, this is new information. So, acidic, negative, small. So, we need to get rid of all the other ones. Those are mediums or bigs? Those are large. Okay, you're good. So, we need to get rid of the large ones. And we need to get rid of the anything that's not negative. So, uncharged or positives. There we go. And... That did it. Third round. I'm seeing two? No, what are you? Oh. All of those are smalls. So let's get rid of all of the larges. You are a negative, so uncharged gets rid of all of those. And unfortunately, these are both acids. So this one failed. So, I guess I can't go back by clicking anything else. I'll just do that, fail it. Okay, try it again. So this time, let's get rid of the mediums. Which gets rid of this guy, who is a competitor. Alright, now we can get rid of the... He is a negative. Get rid of all of the uncharged. And get rid of anything that's not an acid. So neutrals. And there's our third one. Okay. So... We now know how to do this. Hemoglobin purifier. A blood coagulator. So that's... Inventory's full. Okay, let's get rid of some things. Resins were... Um, num, num, num. I don't remember. Liquids. Liquids, there you are. Okay. So you guys go in there, and let's freeze these guys before they go bad. So toss all of you in there. We'll deal with you later. Do you need to? You don't need to. I'm going to make another one of these rather than cook them. All right, so now let's get a hold of this guy and see what that did for us. Are you truly different? You are a... Yeah, hemorrhagic... Hemorrhagic? Fever. Hemorrhagic fever. Okay, so you are new. Drop you down there. You're a third layer now. Let's get another one of those. So toss you in and analyze. And it's a known virus now. So apparently we didn't do it last time. Or before. Okay, so that's going to take care of that. Still, it is not a medical reagent. So, what do I want here? I want you, toss you, and let's leave you. Let's go over here now. Okay, so, yeah, medical reagent. So we got to figure out what that is. And I want what? Drop you off. Right there. Okay. And you two. I don't need you. You're just biological parts. Now, so this guy, to get the immunity booster, maybe that's what we need to go into places that are infected with this new enemy. That could be it. Um, we need the fungal, the gastroenteritis so we gotta figure out what causes that fabricator what is new here blood coagulant booster oh and a hemoglobin purifier which is a bruce flower and canola that's a bruce flower and canola well we're here let's go take care of that this episode's probably going to go long that's fine we're just exploring all the things and wow there's no I can't even run. I've still got vertigo. Okay. 
Um, let's go bring back up a tat as well. Let's boost this up, get some foods, make sure our immune system is as good as it's going to be. Okay. So let's... Um, eat... Okay, you're there. Um, you are there. We've got you there. And I don't see us needing the batteries for a while. Think, think, think. Batteries, batteries, batteries. There? No. There. No. <laughs> I only did this a half hour ago. There you... That's my backpack. What am I looking at here? There we go. Don't think it was you, but it is going to be you now. It makes sense that it's near the charger, so this power stuff. You are just... Un you're just confusing. You are back up as well. Okay. And you are repairs over there. These things look dirty. I guess that's just the lighting reflecting on them. Yeah. Okay, so Bruce Flower and Canola and my endurance still doesn't last very long or stamina. So maybe my immune system is naturally taking down this virus on its own very slowly because the immune system is is good. That might be a thing. Maybe that's why the bar is slowly going down the yellow bar over there. Okay, so... Ink bulbs. Let's grab petites. Petites ink bulbs. Okay. Patat. Patat. Petite bruise flower. Let's get... At least two bruise flowers. Maybe more. Let's get more. And plenty of canola. And we'll make several of those bruise flowers. Assuming that they don't have a short shelf life. You. And that's enough there. Let's work on these guys. Already exhausted. That's probably because of the virus. But this is going to be painful. <laughs> I won't make you guys wait through it. I'll work on this. I'll be right back. And... Oh, I'm exhausted. Of course, when you've got the flu or something, you don't have a lot of energy to do things. So I won't say that isn't realistic. If you've got vertigo all the time... Yeah, I would think that they would make your food level drop fast. Just to, just to symbolize losing your stomach once in a while from the vertigo, from uh, you know, motion sickness. Which I'm sure some of you get watching me play this game naturally. <laughs> now, I want to know, we ate a patat, and it didn't cure us like it should have. So let's boil a patat and see if eating that makes this go away. Otherwise, what was that? Oh, hello, what are you? Oh, okay. Uh, here. What is with this? Is that our medical reagent? I don't know. And new graphics when you research something. See if I can do that again. Have anything? Paint tool. Uh, transformer. To know the. Now, yeah. well, you can back up and look at this. Kind of a, a, a flame gaseous um, effect inside there. Um, you. What just happened there? Removes hemorrhagic viruses from the patient's blood. A Hemoglobin purifier. Interesting. Let's make as many of those as we can. 
All right, let's eat this guy. Consume. Uh, e hold. Well, nothing said anything, so that didn't help. Okay, let's do you again. We'll store those away. So that took all the ink bulbs. Okay. So put those over here. Let me know what this means. In fact, maybe we'll... Hmm, fuels are there. Okay. Maybe we organize this later and put all of these kind of things in one and all of these kind of things in another. Um, I'm going to go back and get some more parts to make more of these. Be right back. Actually, no. Before I do, we're about to hit the end of this bar, so let's hang around and see what that does. Um, otherwise, I can put this guy in here with the fuels. Uh, right there. And we can fix this, because that's driving me nuts. And you guys watch when that bar dies there to see what happened. Whoa! <laughs> Virus was neutralized. And I need therapy. <laughs> That's quite a noise they chose to use. What kind of a virus was that thing? Yeah. yeah we won't go there. Okay. So, anything above? Nope, we're happy there now. Alright, I'm going to get some more bruise flowers. Okay, well, harvesting canola that time was simple. Swipe, 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 and it was done. So, big difference when you're not diseased. Um, right here. Nope, not here. Right here. One more of you. One more. Okay. So, while you're cooking, um, let's see if I can store those, those, and those. Okay. Just to have them. I'm there. Seems like I remember seeing in an update they actually have completely frozen now the. Uh, the timer. So one day, 19 hours and 32 minutes is what it's going to be forever that is in this freezer. I think that's the case now. They actually, you know, a lot of people complained. You know, if it's frozen, it should be locked in time. So that's, I think that was the change. So if you know that, confirm it for me in the, in the comments. Otherwise, let's, let's do one last thing this episode, because I still want to find an answer. There. The lily pad right there. Orange level, so the lowest level platform with the lily pad also has a um, a greenhouse like area. So let's see if over there, I've seen pictures of the bees and they seem to be in a place like that. So lily pad is right in front of us now and way down low. Can I go down? I think I can. In fact, let's just drop. I think it's closer than I think. Anything else around me? No, nope, there you are. Okay, so that should be at 128 if I remember right. No, 120. That's right. Yeah, this one gives a warning. You're, you're down too low. I'll leave it right there. Low altitude warning. Okay. Hop out of this. And inventory is fine. And we'll jump out the front. Yeah. That's a good ship design, I tell ya. I'm gonna toot my horn over and over again. I like that ship. <clears throat> Can head out three different directions. Sun melons. You too? Nope. So this guy right here might unlock something. And that heads out over there. Looking for more sun melons. Let's go up here. We'll hit that area last, because if it's full of bees... A storm is coming. A storm is coming, but we're fine. Oh, another green haven. I'll take it. Just for fun. You, you, you... 
And I get to edit out some more loud thunder noises. I don't need any more posters. Open you. What we got? Moss table. Okay. So what have I missed? There's always something. There you are. Okay, we're good. We're good. Now, let's head down. Yeah. To here. And down like so. Don't have room for you. Are you another... Bruce Flower. Good. We can make another one of those. Another melon? No melons. Okay. Do we have... I don't see a beehive in here. So it's not necessarily at all of them then. Okay. Um... Doors here. Hydration level is decreasing. No, nope, don't see anything in there. Just chilies and more canola. Okay, so nope, that's not it. All right. So let's see if let's not hold this lightning rod in my hand. How do I get out of here? Right here. So, like so. Oh, that's tight. There we go. Back inside. We shouldn't get hit down here at this level. So that should be safe lightning-wise. Let's close all these so we can have some quiet. Everything else is closed. Okay. All right, so we know we can make... Let's see, let's grab a canola. We can make one more of these and the the sun melon also made another one of these so we'll do that and you okay and sun melons also boost your your health so i'm going to toss one in here and boil it huge health boost there water drink drink uh, one more. There we go. And we will add you to our statement piece. <laughs> I want to grow plants on my ship. All right, so you are done. You are done. Put you away and store one more of you. Photophobia. Oh, we don't actually have any of these. Wait a minute here. So I need to f get more of these guys. I'd like to have at least three of everything. Okay. Do I have room for you guys? I do. Let's get all the fuels out of here. Fuels are over here now. Yeah. So red, green, brown. And then what makes brown and what makes green? That works. Hello. Researched. No. No cooker okay so in that case pull out you guys put you in there there's our fourth variety and toss all of you and all of you got one more of you here let's go and eat this guy which gives us well, it's only five health. Okay. Seems like there was a lot more. There was a definite advantage to cooking and eating sun melons. Anyway, eat you and feel good about it. To-do list tracked. Find research reports in the laboratory. I don't know what that means. I didn't see anything else to read. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we'll have to hit a, a second underdust. Yeah. Um, to make this booster... Oh, that was it. Hypothermia. We need... Well, it was the photophobia. But we need medical reagents. Okay. So if you guys know what medical reagents are, please let me know how you find them, how they work... Otherwise, I could be fumbling around for the next several episodes just, you know, shot in the dark, and I don't like to do that. So I'm going to call this one here. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will catch you next episode. See you later. Bye-bye.